Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wilkie here, and I'm here with some Teppin. This time I'm gonna be using, I'm gonna be using my boy Nigrigante one more time. The last video that you saw with me was a blue-green, my attempt at a blue-green. An extremely early blue-green, by the way, so I hope that, um, um, it's very, it was very rough in the kind of trial stages of trying to figure out what's going on with this game. But this one is kind of the deck that I've actually gone, um, almost champ with, and I think I'm gonna try and make it the champ with it. God willing, um, I'm gonna go in there. I should have showed the deck list. I showed the deck left the deck list after this match. But basically, you want to create such an advantage that it does not even matter that you're one eight one HP, and you do not want to ever run into um, Ryu. Uh, of course, we're gonna fight Knives Out Jill, so we should be fine. I'm not gonna keep this hand. Swap it all. This is a much better hand. Uh, relatively speaking. Basically, I'm going to open up with Dynamo and Zombie. And we'll go from here. Let's see how it goes from here. Ah, oh, dang it. Stinger would have been good last turn. Ooh, we got Urza. though. That's going to help out a bit. Oh, that's fine. He can die. This is very unfortunate, though. Uh, click the hit. So Dynamo gets full power now. Okay. Why isn't anything going on there? Okay, there we go. Oh, did I experience the glitch? Possibly. Whatever works out to my benefit, I'll use, I guess. Uh, this person might have just quit on me. Because they had to deal with the glitch. I really have no control. There you go. Yeah, I would leave too. So if people don't know, there's a glitch with Nergigante, which has been in the game since day one, where sometimes you just your your thing won't counterattack, which is super unfortunate. Oh, I'll actually reach level fifty with Nergigante. Later, I've already left feedback, Teppin. I've already said you're very good. What more do you want from me? Damn. Okay, let's see. Let me show the deck. Here it is. Spike launch. So we got um, the one. There's two. I would add in two cards. I don't have Forbidden Fruit, which is a legendary black card that I would absolutely run if I had it. If I had one more uh, Malthus, I would run it. And if I had, there's a legendary seven to Val. I would run Val if I had him, but I don't. So this is what I got currently. Um, this deck 100% does not want to run into Ryu at all. Ryu is maybe his weakest. Um, person to fight against and the reason is is that Ryu can kill you out of nowhere and when you're constantly running a deck that has you at one hp you don't want to fight the one guy in the entire world that's like what if i just dealt one hp to you right now and we stopped talking it's kind of like oh cool but oh i'd love running into Ouroboros. i should not be confident in videos because every time i'm confident that's when i lose i'm gonna keep this hand because this is maybe one of the best hands you can have with this specific deck against um, Wesker specifically. Okay, so we're gonna activate him. Put zombie out. Mm, okay, so that's enough now. Oh, we have another stinger. Oh, that works too. Because I can only take a certain amount of damage from him anyway. So who cares? Oh, and then we can play. Poison! Everyone's favorite. I'm gonna try and activate this. Now, here's the thing. Very unfortunate. If he actually is able to buff it, I'm kind of done. He needs this card to survive, though. Ah, oh, thank god. Yeah, I've definitely had people buff... Um, buff her, and not buff her, buff him. Um, and it's super unfortunate. All right, we're doing good so far, though. Not not, not amazing, but all right. Okay, he's down. Boom. Wait for him to activate that, and there we go. Eight. 9, 10, 11. Okay. That should be exactly enough. Thank the Lord. Alright. I'm gonna save up a little bit now. 
That's fair. No, yeah, you lose. Surrender. Whew. See, here's the thing. If you can survive the Nergigante rush at the beginning, this game, this deck has... Oh, we did it. Level 50. All right. Let's do it. Win two, win two games with the hero Rathalos. Me, never. All right. 50th, 50th win. Let's go. Let's see if I can get into A1 with this. Um... What was the thing I was trying to say? Um, now I want to say this deck overall is just very hard to deal with. Like, I was gonna say there's no mid game, but there totally is a mid game. Oh, this person's a champ with an X. I might lose this one. I'm gonna keep this hand. And I'm also gonna play my Nello because who cares if you stop it? Ooh, that's actually kind of unfortunate, but hey. Should be fine. This right here. It's just a zombie, so I don't care if it dies or not. Oh come on. Can I play Birkin before? Good. Play Birkin again? Damn it. Damn it. They weren't going to play a card regardless, but it's fine. That's a slight misplay on my hand, but it's fine. Okay, let's see. Current life loss is 11. Not bad. Could certainly be worst. Okay, we just need one more HP loss and we'll activate the effect. Okay, not bad. Now this is the part where things get tricky. Actually, I lied. No! Damn it! Okay, let me see. I need exactly four. I got four. Craftivate four. This is an open and shut case. Now please... Believe my, <laughs> believe my face. Okay. He surrenders, because that's it. Whew! Good roll, good roll, good roll. Again, Spike Launch is very good because it does not target, so all the things with Veil... Oh, Giant Killer times two. Can we make it into Champ in this very video? We're going to go in one more time. I'm obviously pushing my luck. Uh, oh, do I have enough for a pack? Can I buy a pack? I can't buy a pack. Can I get a No Pity Rate Legendary? No, I can't. Oh, I didn't have this one, so that's good. I don't run purple right now, but hey, if I ever feel like it, let's go back in there. Okay. Whew. I am nervous right now. <laughs> I'm always nervous on the, the climb up to champ. But if we can make it into champ, baby, that'd be fantastic. Another Ouroboros player. Great. This Ouroboros player can again beat me at any point. Keep this hand. I like Birkin in the hand. So I'm going to keep Birkin. Let's see if this was a gamble. Okay, not bad. I definitely need more... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? Sacrifice. There we go. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Let's see, I'm gonna go a little up here. There we go. That'll help. That means I'm not gonna be able to play any cards for a bit. Let's see where it goes. Let me see if I can charge up a bit. I don't mind taking damage. taking damage as long as I can come back from it it's all fine there we go. and then boom I don't have enough to kill them both damn it that's okay 
Oh boy, baby. Ooh. I want poison back, so I'm gonna sacrifice poison. Please activate another effect. No, damn it. Okay. Okay. Again, don't worry. Perfect. I just need bodies on the field right now. Okay, okay. We got it. Don't worry. Deal three damage. Now he's gonna bring something back. The worst possible thing to bring back, too. This might be it. This might be it. That's it now. Yep. Dang it. He just had too good of a hand. He had too good of a hand. I could not stop it. Shame. Real shame. Lost one of the stars, but there you go. I think that's a pretty good showing of um, of Nergigante here. Good, some good games, some good swings, and it showed that Living Death is really a pain in the ass when you get it working early on. <laughs> Deck card's still very good. Not as good as I thought in the past, but whatever. Doesn't matter. Still good card. Good card beat me. End of day. End of discussion. All right, everyone. I want to say have a good. I want you all to have a good day. No, that's not how I end this video. I should say, if you like this video, you should leave a like. Um, yes, if you're not subscribed to me, you should subscribe. And then now I can say, I want you all to have a good day, good night, and have a good life. Thank you, goodbye, see you later, bye-bye.